Hello and welcome back to Cafe Make Math. It's Mrs. Saunders, again. And we're back for episode two of Algebra Vocabulary. In the last video, we learned about expressions, variables, coefficients, constants, operators, and terms. In this video, we only have one word to cover. That's it, just one. You ready? Do you remember in episode one, I told you that mathematicians love shortcuts. Instead of saying two quarters and three dimes and seven pennies, we can just say 2q plus 3d plus 7p. Easy. But what if I want to know how much money I have? Well, I can figure that out. In math, we have a more sophisticated word for figure it out. We say we evaluate the expression. And to evaluate an expression, you just plug in what you already know. So in this case, I know that quarters are 25 cents, dimes are 10 cents, and pennies are one cent. So we'll plug that in. Here, wait, um, let me switch to a chalkboard so we can work it out. Okay, so we've got our problem here, and let's plug in what we know. Quarters are 25 cents, so I'll just write 25 in place of Q. Dimes are 10 cents, so I write 10 instead of D. And pennies are one cent, so I write one instead of P. And I wanna bring down my plus signs so I don't forget them. Let's keep going. I know that two times 25 is 50, three times 10 is 30, and seven times one is seven. So I add all that up, and now I know. I have 87 cents. I've just evaluated that expression. Hey, that's it for episode two of Algebra Vocabulary. Stay tuned for the conclusion in episode three when we wrap it all up. For now, I've got 87 cents to spend and that's enough to buy my favorite candy bar. I mean, I guess I could buy an apple. It's healthier.